Hello everyone. In this uh, video, I will be sharing some information which uh, a learner must know before they start their Abacus course. The information that I will be sharing now will help you have the correct expectations from this Abacus course and also help you gain the most from it. Okay, so please uh, understand the points that I am sharing here uh, very carefully and do uh, consider them when you do your abacus practice and progress through the course. The first most important point to know before starting the abacus course is the main aim of this course. Remember abacus course is not a maths improvement class. Many people consider this because they have seen other children who have completed this course be very uh, comfortable with maths, very comfortable with numbers and uh, perform excellently on that front. But remember, Abacus course is a brain exercise course. When Abacus calculations are done at a decent speed, it helps generate good amount of exercise for the brain. With regular exercise, regular brain exercise of this kind over a period of time, it helps develop several abilities in the brain, help improve those abilities. And this is the ultimate aim of the Abacus course. When little kids they progress through the Abacus course, they start dealing with medium size to even large size numbers at a very early age. And this confidence and comfort with the numbers ultimately helps them be very comfortable with math, several maths concepts in later years as well. So it ultimately helps even with uh, maths performance in school and other studies as also. But it's not the only positive effect of the Abacus course. It ultimately helps develop the child's brain or the learner's brain. And that remains the ultimate and the most important aim of this Abacus course. The most important requirement to gain the most from the Abacus course is sincere everyday practice. A few minutes of sincere everyday practice. Remember these three words. This is the most important thing. Any learner who sincerely practices Abacus methods every day for at least 15, 20, 25 minutes will gain the most in terms of uh, mental benefits, like uh, his abilities will develop immensely. But any learner who does it very irregularly, let's say once in a week or twice in a week, he won't be able to gain substantially from this course. Okay, so remember these three words, sincere everyday practice. It's the most important part of this course. The aim of any learner should be initially when they are new to this uh, concept, new to the formulas, they should start slow. Focus on using the, each formula accurately. This will be very important part of building a good foundation. So start slow, focus on maintaining good accuracy and then as you gain confidence with the use of different formulas, start improving your speed and with regular practice this will happen automatically. But remember, focus on accuracy throughout, in, from right from the first day. Accuracy will be very important because as you improve your speed, if you don't maintain your accuracy, this won't result in the best possible way. Okay, so the, to gain most, focus on accuracy and then with regular practice, improve your speed. The brain exercise generated from regular abacus practice will help in improving the learner's mental abilities which I have mentioned in front of you. The very important thing points are speed of thinking. Okay, speed of thinking will automatically improve as uh, his speed on the abacus improves. Concentration, alertness, memory, all these things also start developing as the uh, learner progresses through the course with more and more practice all the formulas is very easy it can be done in a very short duration even little kids of age seven or eight years can understand the use of all the formulas in let's say a month or two uh, elders can do it even faster uh, in less much lesser time 
but remember understanding the use of formulas is one thing one needs to practice it on the abacus with uh, with different several sums to so that one can gain confidence in use of all these formulas in all possible situations that is the ultimate aim because unless one gains confidence in use of formulas he or she cannot gain speed of doing abacus calculations okay so practice is very important and with practice one needs to gradually keep improving speed then go to a higher challenge means uh, in increase the number of uh, digits in the sum or increase the number of uh, numbers in the sum and keep challenging more and more so that you gain more more and more speed and which ultimately will result in more and more brain exercise that will be the ultimate uh, aim of this course okay so sincere everyday practice for several months is a must with higher and higher challenge as you get more and more comfortable with a particular difficulty level so i am offering stage wise workbooks here which will help provide ample practice with each difficulty level okay so for stage 1 the difficulty level will be relatively easy gradually as one a learner gets comfortable with that difficulty then moving to stage 2 will provide a higher challenge with regular practice the learner will get comfortable with that difficulty level as well and then move to a higher challenge in the next stage in this fashion the say stage wise workbooks that i am offering will help generate increasing amount of brain exercise for the learner okay normally any abacus institution will give admission to kids who are under 12 years of age they prefer the age bracket of uh, let's say 6 to 12 years of age okay so there is a reason why that focus uh, they focus on this age bracket this age bracket uh, the kids are still having a brain which is still in the developing stage and when this kind of brain exercise that is generated from abacus calculations this exercise is given to such developing brains it results in maximum benefits let's say be it speed of thinking be it memory be it concentration and the most important ability is the visualization ability this ability will develop only when kids of this age bracket do sincere abacus practice every day okay so this ability may not be possible for older kids adults okay even irrespective of the amount of uh, abacus practice they do every day i have seen that because in so many years uh, despite uh, lots of practice i have not been able to develop the visualization ability but i have seen little kids develop that in a few months time and this is amazing the result one has to actually see it to believe it apart from the visualization ability older kids and adults can certainly benefit from the other stuff like uh, speed of thinking be it memory concentration or alertness these things will be useful to them in all walks of life be it in their studies be it in the sports be it in extracurricular activities be it in their career somewhere okay so in all these uh, activities this these all these benefits will certainly help them now coming to senior citizens i have received uh, certain uh, messages comments from uh, some senior citizens as well who said that they are feeling great by learning abacus and practicing it now this got me thinking that uh, brain exercise which helps develop certain abilities in uh, kids or even in younger adults this brain exercise will also help senior citizens keep their brain cells more active more healthy and this will ultimately help them avoid things like alzheimers or amnesia or other such uh, brain related uh, diseases from creeping in and this will ultimately help them lead a more fulfilled life right so senior citizens too can benefit from this brain exercise part of the abacus course very soon i'll be sharing specific guidelines stage wise guidelines of how to progress through the course and practice uh, this abacus methods uh, from if, with the use of stage wise workbooks that i'm offering if any of you who have who haven't ordered the workbooks yet you can have a look at the details of the workbooks at the link given in the description below have a look if you feel interested you can order it and start your abacus practice from the comfort of your home my videos are there to give provide all the knowledge but the important part is practice practice needs to be done by you